this is Phil from Make Tech Easier and welcome to six of the best screenshot apps for Mac OS. By default, Mac OS contains a pretty impressive collection of screenshot capabilities, but if you take a lot of screenshots, you might start to notice limitations. Check out these third party options to expand your screenshot toolset. Monosnap. Monosnap is a uniquely powerful screenshot tool. The screenshot utility is slim and easy to use. You can invoke an area or a full screen capture from the keyboard and you'll have access to the annotation tools as soon as the capture is taken. When you're happy with your annotations, you can export a JPEG or PNG file or even send the app to an external editor like Photoshop. Interestingly, the app can also record screen video or take selfies with your Mac's front facing camera. If you pay for the Pro version, you can also integrate the app with cloud services like Evernote. The selection tools are hyper accurate with pixel perfect zoom for selecting boundaries easily. The app's only downside is a lack of application window captures which you'll still need to do with the default app. Otherwise it's got just about everything you could want in a screenshot app which makes it a powerful companion for anyone who needs to take a ton of screen captures. Skitch. Even if Skitch is getting a little long in the tooth, it's still one of the best image notation apps available. As a screenshot creation app, it's perfectly serviceable, but its annotation tools are where the app really shines. Marking up images is fluid and simple, with an obvious interface and just enough options. It's our go-to tool for drawing an arrow on something, even if we use the default macOS tools to actually make a screenshot. Snap and drag. Our favourite feature of Snap and Drag is the library. Rather than capturing screenshots to your desktop or other directory, it instead embeds them in a library file. This avoids cluttering up your directory with five slightly different images of the same interface. When you get one you like, you can export it as your choice of image format. You can take many different types of screenshots with timed and instant options available. The annotations aren't as great as Skitch, however. But the main drawback of Snap and Drag is the cost. The full version of the app is $10 and functionality like resizing screenshots to arbitrary dimensions costs another 10 bucks on top of that. With core features locked behind a fairly steep paywall, it's hard to recommend the app. Lightshot. Lightshot is a lightweight screenshot utility with limited but useful functionality. Once the utility is invoked, the user selects their screen with a drag tool. Once the drag is complete, the user can use a floating utility to annotate the image in place. Then it can be saved either to the user's hard drive or an online utility called printscreen.com and shared publicly. That's really it. If you just need a utility in infrequently created annotated screenshots, Lightshot is a great choice, but it might not fulfill the expectations of power users. Snagit. Snagit is another professional grade screenshot utility with a cost to match. It might be the most powerful utility on the list with a nearly bewildering array of annotation options and features. It's truly immense and it's perfect for users that need to create screenshots constantly. Professionals that need extensive annotation might find the extended utility to be worth the $50 cost. If you want to try it out, you can get a 15 day free trial with all the features unlocked. And if you like Snagit, but you can't get behind the cost, you might try Jing instead. It's by the same developers, but free and sharing images over their social service. Snaps Pro 10. Snaps Pro 10 is the favorite of many long time Mac users with aged adherence to the platform, remembering it's long lost version one. It's one of the longest lived screenshot apps, as well as one of the more powerful. In addition to a robust screenshot capability, the app can create video from any part of your Mac screen. It can capture both system output and microphone input, which makes it especially well suited to creating tutorials. You can use it to take static screenshots and you'll find an impressive range of functionality. The app's cost, however, is pure madness. A full license is $69. Unless you need something to make videos with constantly, you're better off with a cheaper application. Conclusion. If you want the best of all worlds, Monosnap is a great choice. Power users can get more out of an app like Snagit or Snaps Pro 10, and occasional screenshot makers might like the lightweight light shot. Okay, as always, thanks for watching, and please subscribe and add your comments below. See you next time.